I'm Cameron Real, and this is my life and mission. You don't always see the workplace of a missionary, but today I'm going to show you my workplace, the sixth grade classroom at Ebi SDA School. This is where I spend every day of these 10 months that I'm here uh, teaching these kids. There's 26 kids in this classroom, and this is where I spend every day. It's on the third floor of the building uh, of the Ebi SDA School, the top floor, which is really great. Uh, let me show you around a little bit. So uh, we've added, as you can see, some art. To the, to the classroom, lots of student art. I love promoting student art, so we've added some of that. And these, it, it's, it's a double whammy because one, the students painted that, but two, it helps them learn the books of the Bible, which is really great. I've also added these. I got these uh, when I went on a trip and brought them back. Uh, these are some posters. I got a United States one and a, a world one. And I think this is really great because it helps the students here who are on this really tiny island. They don't always have access to travel or to, to resources that allow them to, to visit the world. And so even a map like this allows the students, you know, allows their mind, allows their thoughts to wander and to kind of like explore other worlds, which is really great. Right now we're learning about India. And as you can see over here, I have lots of resources. I've got a whole shelf of colored pencils. I got Play-Doh. I have games and whatnot. All these resources that have been provided to me from friends and family and other missionaries, which has really been great. But one of the things that I'm really proud of is I got two whole shelves of books right here, which I've been working hard to collect because the, 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 the kids love to read. And having these books here, uh, I had some of my friends and family in the States send me, I've gotten about six boxes of books already, and so more are on the way, and the kids love them. The kids love reading these books, and so I love to, to have these books available for them at their ready. Um, I even have some more that I'm still going through. Lots and lots of that. My kids recently won the middle school science fair here at Ebi SDA School, so I decided to throw up their science project on the wall to really appreciate their hard work, their determination, and you know, to tell them, hey guys, you guys worked hard, good job. Here's your work. So I'm really proud of that for them. As you can see, uh, like I said, third floor, it's really hot, but we do have these open windows which helps the breeze come in and out and keeps the classroom cooler, but it's still kind of hot as you can see by the sweat on my brow. But as you can see, right now we're doing testing so the desks are set up in a weird way, but this is the classroom and we try to, uh, we try to have fun and do the best. But you know, I wouldn't be able to do what I do without the missionaries that are here helping me uh, with my classroom management, helping me do the sorts of things uh, that I do as a teacher. I rely a lot on the previous missionaries who've been here and also missionaries who've been here for multiple years because I can rely off them and rely on them. Not only as a missionary do we need to rely on God, but we need to rely on the other missionaries who are here. We need to rely on our coworkers in order to get the job done right. So I rely not only on the missionaries here, on God, but also my friends and family at home. 